Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm talking with a lisp right now because I have this retainer thing in my mouth, so just ignore that for the intro of this video. It won't be like this the whole video, I swear. And the reason why I have this retainer in my mouth is because I actually just had a teeth whitening treatment done at my dentist office. And right now there's like this soothing gel on with a retainer in. So anyway, that's what's going on. It was really cool though, because when they first started the treatment, they put this stuff on my gums to protect my gums from the whitening stuff. And then they put the whitening, you know, gel on or whatever, and then the blue light. And you know, I felt really cool wearing the sunglasses and whatnot. So anyway, this video is going to be about my little glow up getting ready for vacation. Eric and I leave for vacation next week. So I thought it just would be fun to film a little video about just some of the random things that I'm doing this week to get ready to go to a beautiful tropical destination. Now that I just had the teeth whitening treatment done, the next thing that I need to do, I'm putting the address into my mouth right now, is I need to go pick up my bridesmaid's dress. I had to get it tailored because I'm short and it was just way too long on me and she tailored it so it would just fit me better and I'm about to go pick it up. I forgot to mention the vacation that we're going on is for my best friend Tiffany's wedding and I am a bridesmaid in the wedding, so that is why I need to go pick up my dress. Oh my gosh, that sun is so bright. I'm sorry, but Eric and I went shopping earlier today and I actually didn't find anything that I really liked for myself, but Eric found some nice dress shirts, so he's gonna bring those with him on the vacation. Oh, I did get one thing for myself. So I had a gift card to Sephora, so I bought some new blush. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm really excited about it. And now I'm actually in the parking lot of my nail salon. I'm about to go get my nails done. And I have like a piece of the fabric from my bride bridesmaid's dress and I'm gonna bring this in and I really hope that they can color match it as closely as possible and that I can get my nails done in this color so that is what I am about to go do now so I will give you guys an update as soon as my appointment is over okay nails are done I think they came out so pretty i love the color it's kind of hard to see in this light but i think they came out really good and it's exactly what i wanted it's a very similar color to my dress so i think it's gonna look great oh hello luna big stretch big stretchies so I think the last time I vlogged about getting ready for my trip, I had just gotten my nails done. But today, Eric and I actually went and got haircuts. Um, he just got his haircut and then I got mine dyed. I got some blonde highlights and I think it came out really cute. Eric and I are going to this little cocktail party at his cousin's house. And so this is what I'm gonna wear tonight. I have this shirt, it says Paris on it. Thought that was really cute. My flare jeans from Target. And then these are my Tom's wedges. So, and then I think I'll wear my leather jacket over this because it is still kind of cold here. And then tomorrow is Easter, so we're gonna celebrate that. And then I definitely need to start packing for our trip because we leave the day after tomorrow and I definitely don't like packing the day of leaving. So I'll do that tomorrow, but I think we need to get going. Hey everybody, so we are actually back from vacation now. So originally I had wanted to film an entire section of this video about packing and whatnot like the finishing touches, getting ready for a trip, but life as we all know it just got really busy and chaotic and so I'm sorry, I didn't film that, but I do have a full vlog from our St. Lucia trip that will be coming to this channel and my Jetting Julia channel, but I thought it would be fun to talk to you guys about the books that I did pack with me on this vacation. Did I read all of them? No, but I brought them with me. So 
The first book that I brought with me on vacation and that I actually did finish is this book called Broken Bonds. This is book one of the Bonds That Tie series. It is a fantasy, spicy, college-aged romanticy series, I guess you could call it. And I go into further details about this book during my St. Lucia vlog where I'm actually reading it. So I'm not going to talk about this in too much depth, but I did really like this. I gave it four stars and I definitely plan to continue the series as well. Um, a few other books that I did bring with me. I brought Bride with me by Allie Hazelwood. I just thought this would be fun to bring on vacation with me because I was there for my friend Tiffany's wedding and she's a bride, so I thought this would be cute. Although I didn't get to this one, but that's okay. Uh, but anyways, if you are interested in reading this book, the back of the book says, Misery Lark, daughter of a powerful vampire councilman, is an outcast. Her days of living anonymously among the humans are over. She has been called upon to uphold an alliance between the vampires and their mortal enemies, the wares. Wares are ruthless and unpredictable and their alpha low moorland is no exception he rules his pack with an absolute authority but not without justice or feeling it's clear from the way he tracks misery's every movement that he doesn't trust her if only he knew how right he was and i believe there is a romance between misery and low i think it's like an arranged marriage type of thing so i think this will be really fun to read once i get to it and then i also brought book one to the magnolia parks series and and this is a series that I have just been really wanting to get into for a long time. I just, I don't know, I just haven't found the time to like sit down and actually read it yet. But the back of the book says that Magnolia Parks is a beautiful, affluent, self-involved, and mildly neurotic London sociolite. BJ Ballantyne is Britain's most notorious and, and photographed bad boy who broke her heart, but these two are meant to be and everybody knows it. So this book definitely gives me Gossip Girl vibes and I loved the show Gossip Girl, so I am excited to eventually get to this book. And then and the other book that I actually started on this trip and I am still reading is I read novella one which is called The Risk and that's part of the Mind FCK series and that is actually my book club's pick for the month of April so if you are not part of it I highly recommend joining my book club over on the Fable app I will put a link to it in the description box below so anyways I am really really enjoying that series so far and I'm already on the second book there's definitely more footage from this trip coming soon so stay tuned for that I hope that you all are having a fabulous day. Thank you so much for watching today's video. If you liked it, please give me a big thumbs up. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe because I'd love to see you again in future content. And yeah, thank you again so, so, so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!